Looks like this HE that I just highlighted in the hands of Hunter could be destined for damage. Yeah, when does he throw it though? What's the cue? Kick it's quite ahead of the pack. Now the smokes are released, as is Hunter's nade. Good chip damage, and it's Hunter to find the first onto kick it. Into the site is one, and it's Fame does great work, makes space, two on the Glock to get the party started. Nico's got a flank. The round is not won yet. Flit's in position to deal with it, address it when necessary. And how diligent will Nico be on his clears? First bullet to be fired from Mr. Kovac, and he's already get caught outside of the head. Perfect start to pistol proceedings for VP. Fame made space. Oh, JKS, he's found two on the way back in. He'd have to find another double. And he has to do it on the double, given the time. No kit available to him. He'll play the time nicely. And yeah, for this situation for JKS, it is rather difficult to find another frag. Never mind a round win. He'll fake it out. James playing the time well. I think, yeah, getting into that site and getting that bomb down has translated nicely into a first round for VP. Oh, another kill here for JKS on the way out the door. But now he needs to get out and save that Kevlar. So some damage done, some kills made, but the round lost, and good job from VP, they run the pistol round. Now this was one of the differences on Mirage that they were unable to get away with versus FaZe, was pistol rounds. FaZe won both. It's the perfect call, really, for this second round conversion. Going to be very hard-pressed unless this timing had a Hunter, but spotted out by Flint. Big one. Can Hooksy finish off the damage the Hunter did find? He's picked up the SMG and the frag. JKS connects on the Deeg. They're committing to the A site. Time light. And Hooksy spots out Jane. Great shot out of Jane, but could be traded here if the Deeg's good. If the Deeg is good. MP9 to the head. Bomb is loose and very uncomfortable now for the remaining two. Fame running him down. Monacy in trouble. Would love to get a frag, but they still would love to get a plant. Maybe Nico can come up clutch and secure this second round forced by victory. With eight seconds left, Kickert investigating. Now they know where you are. Oh. Him down. Good work from Kickert. Now G2, they made him work for it. Yeah, gamble the key word here. This is looking great for VP now. Third round should be secured here. Yeah, good luck, mate. They're coming through it. Or not. Spam connects. Flash turn. JKS, he knows he could be a destabilizing presence, but Kickert does catch him through the smoke, and the rest should just fall into place here. Nico's dig, maybe he hits a banger-ranger onto kick at the track that oh, oh, nails that oh. head to Nico. He seek a sequence of frags, puts it onto Hooksy in the 1v2. This has been costly. Something we've been saying an awful lot so far from G2's rounds. Now, admittedly, more damage would be fine here as well. If he can grab a kill on this, $600 kill reward. And oh, I don't think that's going to happen. Fame spotted him out. Types him away, Hooksy drops, and that is going to be the 3-0 conversion from VP. We are going to get into the guns here, so reflecting on what buys are possible, I'm sure... First gun round for G2. So this is where Monacy can have his first contribution. Holding on towards the ramp side gives JKS a bit of a warning. And he never mind a warning. He's taken down Flit. Now JKS is dumping. Util couldn't get his gun out in time. It's fame to equalize. And now looking to get into the site. Good one back from Nico. All the way from the con side. It's Jim Monacy. Strings together. A sequence of frags, and there is more to be done. Jane around that smoke. Nico's being hunted by Mir. A lot of communication from him. Looking for the deep clear, Nico first victim, Monacy's hit another, and it's... Oh, Mir, he got dinked in the process, but does catch Hooksy. Now, the bomb's lost on eight, and he doesn't really have health for a even odds head-to-head. -head. He's repositioned nicely, Monacy, that's his round from zero to four. In the first gun round, the AWP from G2 shining bright. G2 getting a bit of love early. JK is getting caught off guard there. I don't think he's expecting players just to walk out so freely knowing that there's an AWP over towards Ticket, but trying to punish the bolt. Monacy so far looks sharp. His AWP is about to be tested here, and Nico just hot on their heels in hot pursuit. JKS, if he could delay, Monacy the same. And he has. Monacy connects onto Fame. They'll molly him out. He'll flash for more. Fight or flight. Oh, he's not good. It's not good enough. Finally, they find him. JKS delaying and Nico crawling back. So turn, multi kill required. Nico delivers a double spray fast on the flank, and we are all tied up. More than happy to deal with this, and guess what? VP are coming. Ooh, and so are Nico, Monacy, and Hunter. And so it's mere one shot to the dome. JKS beheaded, and now Monacy. With Nico's support, so not anymore. Kick it's gone, and this is awkward now as three bodies drop for G2. Flip caught off by Hunter, but already stomaching a huge disadvantage. He's going forward on this. Kick it had his nade out. Hunter's dead as well. Kick it very quick on the trigger. Yeah, looking quite sharp in this round, isn't he? Yeah, I, I will agree with the sentiment that you're not going to win trophies if your in game leader's only getting, you know, five or, or whatever kills a game, right? Yeah. But in terms of 
dragging your team behind. Yeah, how many Kalavitsas and Cologne did they win before it? Exactly. So uh, Hooksy's impact uh -oh. has been felt, but Monacy... Oh, that's such a commitment from Monacy. Yeah. I don't, oh. he, you could tell he wasn't ready, could you? Oh. The fact that the pick came from left to right as opposed to... Wait. Yeah. Yeah, right to left. Yeah. I had to put my fingers up there for a second. <laughs> Well, this is two rounds in a row now where G2 have stomached very early losses. And the ramifications of this one is going to sting here. So JKS does have to make a bit of a play here. Nico, window side. Smoked off for now. Oh, JKS could be overlooked if he catches this right. Aim's good for it. Nice adjustment. Good awareness. Looking to keep it clean here. As VP, this is going to be a kind of turning of the tide. Definitely. Right, it was already past the line of sight. We'll catch it here. Wow. Uh, so Monacy not ready for that at all. Uh, so that, that's that's essentially you go, my bad boss, I got caught off guard, right? And that's what you hate to hear as an in-game leader or a coach, like somebody saying, I missed my shot or yep. isolated. And it's all going to come down to JKS's decision making. How much space does he feel has already been taken away from him? He has a little bit of support, Ooh, sure. Oh yeah, dear. The back is exposed here, unless Monacy has a look. Oh, he saved him. Monacy just having a passing glance at the benches, but there's more where that came from. Flits out, Nico's dead, Monacy's watching. Gonna have to fill that gap. Down goes Monacy, fame, a good headshot. JKS, they know he's the A anchor, where is he hiding? In the smoke, only the one looking good for a plant now. Hunter and Hooksy to rotate through. 40 seconds, they don't have to hurry this. Hunter probably gonna take that next fire kick. And he has the bomb out, gonna go down. Hunter couldn't get away, Hooksy. Didn't get spotted by fame, so that information goes just one way. Could lead to a 1v1. He knows James there. He knows James planted. How does he choose to approach this? The Giga Chad brain whirring into action, thinking about it, maybe expecting James to walk through it. Oh, James so really nailed this, hasn't he? There's no way Hooksy's expecting him to be right there on the other side of the smoke. Push it through. <laughs> Could have hit the no scope. Low HP. What have you got for us, Hooksy? Go! My son, Molly, he's got the time, he's got the kit. Hooksy clutches up, 1v2. <laughs> he looks so out of his depth right there and he hits a no-scope headshot. <laughs> he's just orping as a support orber just to hold a line <laughs> and then hits a banger like that. That's so, I mean, that must feel so good. Oh dear. That one. <laughs> Well, a bit of fun to be had right there. Bro, I thought Jamin absolutely gamed him. How, how often does Hooksy win a clutch, let alone a one on two Bang. against Jame? That right there is going to sting. And Hooksy, where we talk about maybe he doesn't need to get the most frags. <laughs> but that right Got a there. smile out of Justin. Yeah, of course it does. That's impact. That's what we were talking about, right? Till about 30 here. So Mir's Lurk will be late. Rotation over now. And I think they have a good idea where this one's going to end. Yeah, they're in a premium spot to deal with it. And Mir actually goes down first. Supposed to be the, one of the last components. Monacy, he does go down. It's a big shot from Fame. Nico wants to strike early, and he has successfully found the head of Kicker. One more added to his list. Puts himself up to a nice total of 13 to 9 so far. Ooh, yeah, flip. Got to be careful with these peaks, but that smoke is fading. Monacy could be susceptible to Mir in a moment. Oh, looked away. Mir should have him. Oh, and on the spray, transfers, first bullet into Nico's head as well. That's one way to use the hero AK. And now an orb's fallen into Flit's hands. Might juggle it to Jame eventually. JKS has got a lot to deal with. He has got Hunter's support though, and Flit would need to find the trade. Barrel spotted, Beer fighting. Brilliant work from Hunter, but still Jame next victim. More to be done, no bullets. Flit will run it down, no they won't. Hunter's good on it. Nails the headshot with a USP, and G2 will leave with eight, but Mir gave everything he had. Oh, Hunter. Too early. Yeah. Mir was still smoked. It's not worked out well, and look at this. An even trade so far. They're jumping into B, and he's not ready for more. Fame already down. Bomb on the floor. Nice shots from Hootsy! <laughs> no way! Nails another no scope, and it's led to perhaps a round. Monacy confirms it. Hooksy the Orpa. He doesn't need no scope. G29, VP6, and this is just the first half of the first map. Fame does have the perfect weapon for the job, or Three weapons. Three coming his way. Yeah, it's about... Remember the headshots I was talking about? Yeah, finding headshots, and wow, Jame and Fame have found theirs. And disadvantage for G2, but into the site, just looking to take these jewels, close the gap, lock up close, more favorable. Jame, trying to play for the retake. So I'm going to take an engagement on his own. And unfortunately, Monacy has helped too. So the bomb's now down. 
They've gotten into the site. It's going to be three through CT jungle side. Event not broken. This flash is... flash. Is anyone anti? Yeah, I think JKS is safe from it. Monacy even considering it. Oh, turns. Needs the headshot. One done from Monacy. Jane will catch him. What have you done? JKS, he's needing frags. He's worried about ramp, understandably so. Two spotted, Nico alone and not ready for Mir. This could be both, it is. They'll take both pistols with just a couple of seconds to spare. Oh, that is so, so close. Nico staying alive for a moment longer. The same to be said for JKS and they could have had that round. You see just how close it is on that defuse. So many bodies around mid to clamp down for VP. Ooh, and Nico, he's been spotted, doesn't finish off Mir, and now opening kills translate to a huge advantage. VP have taken down Hunter thanks to Flitz' handiwork on the FAMAS. Monacy unable to trade, and Flitz getting away. Well played that so well, gets away with it, and it looks like it could be perfect. Five still alive, JKS down, and that is a dream for VP. We're looking at a 9-9 game right here. Gun round, so really lacking damage here, aren't they? Multiple barbs of VP peeking in unison just to make that one easy. And then JKS, where is he? Oh, uh, well, he's the A lurk, so we know where he's coming from, but right. I think he did open one. He did eventually. He's retired now. Shout out to Flush of his. Oh, Doki. JKS, first bullet out of his dig into Mir on the jiggle peak. Might be one of the most impactful kills he's had if they're able to get anything off the back of this. Especially if Flick goes looking, and yeah, that P250's not going to get Hunter very far. You'll see that one again in the top right. Banged him out. Lovely angle from... Oh, it could... God, Monacy. Well aware. Nails the shot. Bumble Flitz cleared down. out mid, but they get the plant. I assume that's where it stops. He's heard Monacy coming. And oh, Monacy, right. superb on the FAMAS. He wants more. He's trying to delay them as best he can. Hooksy only has a Glock, so it really does just have to be Monacy. And he's taken it down as much as he possibly could, but Hooksy's a dead man. Glock. And surely a moment from the grave. Flit will confirm it. But, I mean, all things considered, great deagle shots out of G2 and a bomb plant. Looking for a way to uh, distract yourself, you can do that as well. Oh, Jame onto Monacy. That frustration's going to start to bubble over because Nico's accelerating. Maybe he can get the equalizer. Looking for that tiny gap towards CT side. Flashing himself Spotted. into the fight. This is very threatening now, but not for fame. He's actually gone up over the ticket smoke, catches JKS. Nico noted as well, they know he's around. He doesn't have anyone else to support him with Hunter and Hooksy towards midside. And ooh, nice, over the smoke. Fame overstayed his welcome. Look at this though, they're gonna clamp down multiple angles here. Yeah, he was trying to distract for Hunter. Unfortunately, he eats the flash instead. Oh, oh and Flip puts him to his bed. Only Hooksy now. He's recovered the AWP and he hasn't hit the shot, so he's going to be run down, I'm sure. Oh, uh, he can't run around the map with his eyes closed. Hooksy getting stuck. <laughs> Jane finding him, trying to jump away. And there you have it. VP up to 10. And G2 with another extremely flat T-side round here. Nico undetected alongside for the ride. But Fame and Flit should have this every day of the week. Nico's good for the first headshot, and he's anticipating more bodies and presence. Mir to go down for what a double. Gets them both down. Monacy's Deagle still connecting. Mir taking that fight. Monacy's chipped away. Maybe JKS can finish him. Does so. Hits the head, but still a two-on-two -two emerges. That bomb is actually very light on time. Maybe Hunter can win this. JKS is trying to delay them. They missed the smoke on the bomb. They're trying to find it, kick it. Exposed. Oh, they're going to win the round. This is brilliant play from G2. And they do tie things up 10-10. Not to say that Monacy and Nico can make some space regardless. With Nico holding jungle oh. side and Jamie, he's hit another one here. He's definitely starting to hey, find his closed. form. They're not getting in. They've only got ooh, nice shot. Great one from Nico. Hoping that's distract enough for JKS, but James got just staring at you, mate. What are you supposed to Forget do? Forget about James. Look at Kicker. He's won the round. Yeah, he's got the bomb under wraps, and Nico and JKS still locked out. So we can call this one a one round. Nice shot on Samir. They go down, forcing three rebuys, but VP immediately back to their winning way. They have U2 left as well. And Jame, he did eventually get the better of Monacy in this round right here. Mir, got to be speaking his name too. You've got three players, three riflers, just delivering in a big way right now. Fame, Flit, and Mir.
This is off of the spawn. Just knife out. Gun out. Charging in. Jane one. Fame another. Monacy caught on the ladder. And G2, they try and switch up the pace. And VP greets them with bullets to their face. This is beautiful for VP. Oh, leg shot on Nico. He's lucky. Just mantled up on towards the bricks there. But already, yeah, dire straits for G2. Spending all that money oh, for nothing. The they just keep coming. Oh, Loss Bonus is maxed out here. But they need a plan. I don't think they're going to get that. Oh, they're keeping it clean as well. Hunter's going to ooh, hold on for one. Chased on down. They're coming for you. And it's Mir in the end to find him. Uh, right now, VP are out calling G2. Well, he runs away. So <laughs> his position given up regardless here. But... Couldn't be capitalized in the moment. Oh, defensive connector smoke. 30 seconds left. Kick it with a great info play. G2, this is troublesome. And they want Mir. They're trying That's to bring the bomb. the bomb to him. Need more. Mir gets two. And now they've only got 20 seconds. You need something magical out of Monacy. Can you Flips get to too me? Good. I don't think they can. I don't think they've got the time. They don't have the players. Another brilliant sequence. Flit takes two. Hunter, what are you supposed to do? 10 seconds. He'd love to just leave with the AK. $950 in his bank balance, and it looks like he will get away. Bring that through into our next round of play, but they are running out of opportunities. I feel like there's a bit more to VP in this match. They're willing to take a lot of heads-up fights. They're willing to be a bit more jarring, a bit more confidence, and, and that's showing in these rifles. I've already mentioned the three names. We'll do it again. Flit, Mia, and Fame, all finding impact throughout this game. Yeah, they're being styled on. Competitive half, 9-6, despite the pistol being VPs. Mir. Nice find on to Nico. They need this, and Hunter prov provides, but how are they supposed to convert this round? It would need to be Hunter, and he all Hunter, and he's got nothing to celebrate. Mir gets him on the drop down. 15 looms. It's only Monacy. No armor on this one. And with just 14 HP, kick it. We'll kick him down and make it just a one round away from taking their map pick here. Can he deliver an opener? He has got the best spawn, Chad. Will he take that fight? Will he have success? Flashes for himself. Strafe in out. Looking to try and find something and catch them off guard. He's eating the flashbang and it's flit. The strafe's out wide. He spotted him as well. Will Modesty get away? Or will he actually return the favor? Catches Mir. Short side down. Nico into A as well. Maybe there's more to be said about this yeah, after all. Yeah, good pep in the step this time. They're actually applying pressure. They've realized it's heavy. Mid and Modesty oh, caught oh, off. No. JKS down as well. Just Nico and Hunter to try and call this two on four together. Wow. Do or die. Yeah, even if they waltz into A at any moment. Okay, there's information. It's the bomb. And that is the bomb. It's a very risky maneuver, but you've got to make something happen. There it goes. Round Blitz over. secures it. Surely that's the round. Nico resides himself to accepting that they will not be starting with the win in this series. They'll have to do it the hard way. VP, though, to picking Mirage into G2 and with a stunning CT side. We'll give it everything it's worth. Fame probably tempted to peek out of the palace position now, knowing that the round is his, though. He doesn't need to do too much, and they've got everything covered. Tap on the head to Jane, but Fame, he's got him turned, and will convert. 16 to 11, it is VP. One map away from knocking down G2 here in the quarterfinals. And guess what's next? Inferno. We heard from the coach Swanee in the pregame interview talking about the fact they haven't got to play it against Nine and Ents in recent times. Well, they need to win it now against VP if they want to keep their tournament hopes and dreams alive here at GA. You can't get past me. Essentially on either bomb site. Yeah, and look how disconnected JKS and Hooksy are from this hit. So Basically, it's all onto it's, Nico it's and It's the Monacy. flash from Monacy. It's going to pop perfectly. And Nico needs to kill three. Flash. And it's one, two, and not quite the third. Still, though, the bomb will go down. It's up to Hooksy and JKS to do the rest. A smoke for Hooksy. Maybe he can isolate Fame on that banana side if he can get there. But Flit's already quite forward here in Ruins, and he's got help as well. So, yeah, check this one out. They're audible. Who takes first contact? I think it will be... Jane? Oh, no. Jumping in. Flit will collect. And JKS has got a lot on his plate. Perfect from Flit. Man, he's on one today. That's a quad kill into the pistol. And another pistol for VP. Smoking them off. And Monacy will be called to address it. JKS is here. They've got the setup for this. Three members. And it's actually JKS taking a forward start. He nearly leaves with two. Damage onto Flit as well. Hunter combines for a convincing round. Monacy a miss that doesn't cost him with a snappy headshot out of Hunter. And all that remains is Mir. Long side, spotted by Hooksy and converted as well. So with four alive, G2 on the board in that first gun round. My so, James Orbs out now, Alex. 
Yeah, James Ort might be set for success here on the reclear. Yep, yeah, oh, perfect from Hooksy. Catches just a tiny glimmer of James on Log's position. Oh. He's gonna get a bit greedy on that one. Kick it, it will punish. It was important stubbornness to try and draw one back there. Hanging around for another, he could have called on his teammate, but Hunter now flashed off, spotted, kick it, wild spray, but we'll get the better of him. B's open, Monacy and JKS Ooh. should be looking to save here. Well, no, maybe not save. I don't think so. Then you're just going to turn it into duels. You have, you know, favorable fights coming your way. Oh, G2 are falling hook, line, and sinker for this. They dump their util, they flash through. That's a big play from Nico. Maybe Hunter's going to be overlooked, but this is VP we're talking about. They'll start to spam. Look at fame. That's a flight path and a half. And maybe James dead to AKS, but there's a lot more required if they want to win this two on two. That bomb should be going down. It's Mir that will be punching in the code. Honestly, here. JKS flashed through. Oh, but he was turned. Mir has full vision. Spins on a dime to convert onto the Aussie in Monacy. In a one versus two situation. Star Orpa and so much clutch potential. But with such an investment, Will he want to give this a look in? It's a high risk, but with high reward available. VP looking for their fifth already on this T side. This is G2's pick. Right now, just making mincemeat of them. Great adjustment. Punishes a very tiny fight from fame. Process of elimination. Mir calls the bluff on the fake. Honestly, working it out. Mir will find him. That's triple kill out of Mir. And even bringing home the orb for Daddy J. Here comes some util. Here comes the final 19 seconds. They really are light on time here. And Monacy is rewarded for his patience. A flash to delay. They're running out of options here. 12 seconds. VP, can they really find a way in? Kick it, gives it a go. Bomb lost. Should be the round as well. Oh my god, Fame's found another one. Doesn't have really the time to the plant, so Hunter's just going to kill him after time. Oh! oh Fame! <laughs> Quick adjustment. Jane will maintain the AWP through his teammate. Win bonus. It doesn't really feel like a win. No, and you're going to see that reflected in the purchases here. here it is G2. They've got to take, yeah, they've got to take their second time out already in this half. No AWP for Monacy. We'll still have to be rocking that silence stem four. Hooksy again, and oh. kicker just tucked in. This yeah. time he's going to get the better oh. of him. Woof, that nade nailed him. Combined with the bullets, he's got two HP. He should be a dead man and is the first lick of the flame. And Nico combines with the spam onto Flit. Is he going to activate it first? I thought he'd just try and flash them in. Yeah, great util set to get them through. Nico communicating an awful lot. He looks flustered. He looks stressed. 25 seconds. He wants no help. Just confirmation the two of, them. of the commitment. Hunter to be cleared. Fame is too good. But will they deep clear Nico? He could disrupt the plant. Fame's diligent. Fame too good. He nails it. And it looks like a recovered round. G2, this is going to be a tilter. And now a question remains, do you have a look? Monacy and JKS no, known to be the A defense. Well, the answer is they shouldn't. Jane thinks they shouldn't, but uh, maybe G2 went to a different school. Different education. Different religion. Smoke forward. They are giving it a look. They want to isolate this duel and well, Jane confirmed. And Mir can't believe his luck. Collects another headshot. Fane got him in. And it looks like Mir does go down to JKS. He'd love to leave with the rifle after all of this, but the bomb radius is going to be wide enough. He needs to go. Fane caught off. It's going to be just out of reach if he rounds the corner. Ooh, just like that, JKS at least maintains the AK, but that is a recovered round by VP. They made that look easy. Maybe Hunter and JKS have got what it takes. Quick extinguish, attention drawn to the pit. Does Hunter have a look? He does. Gets one on to kick it. Mir was tacked up in the process as well. Look at the diligence. The flashes are there. Hunter has vision. Hunter has frags. And JKS does not. It's Monacy rotating in in time. And this attempted pace change and punish has fallen flat for VP. Just looked away. So actually, Nico will perhaps catch him off guard on this one. He's coming for the reclear now. How aware is he? Not aware enough. That's a big win. Taking Jame away on the safe. Inferno. So maybe he'll operate with something a little bit different. Maybe drop an AK. We know they like to do these hero AK rounds. First deployed of the five they're operating with. Nico's position safe from oh. Flash is a banging HE. Puts Flit on half health. Oh. That's the problem. They're going to accelerate on that. He's safe from the flashes as we discussed. Now Nico needs to find the multi-kill. Will they isolate him? Kick it. It's not the weapon for the job. They've only got pistols. Finds the rifle now. Good support in flashes from Monacy, keeping them blind. White screens, nades, good. This is the G2 support squad arriving in time. Nico dropped off, but he's found another. James is next victim. And another Nico multi-kill ascends to 11 frags. And the last two with nothing to do.
If Kicker didn't have the bomb there, I think he would have been let off the leash a little bit. Looked like he was in two minds. He knew he had to try and swing to find that kill, but also had the bomb on his back. 20 seconds now, everybody dotted here, and Monacy's AWP will strike. It's just fame to find, and he needs to fall. Picks up the AK short. Madman coming through it, but Hunter <laughs> will rumble that, and it's just a two-round game. So what was looking very weak for G2 has turned into four out of the last five rounds of play, and they can still walk away with the half lead. Just three more here. Jumpy Glock, isn't there? Someone should be jumping, that's for sure. Yes, he does. Nails it on the jiggle from here. Floodgates are open, though. Hunter's there to attend to it. And he's good for the first. Ooh, did take a bit of damage there and could be run down. Holds his nerve for three. I just kick it. Yeah, hitting some shots. <laughs> Only the one casualty. <laughs> what is he kind of giving him a bit of the side eye right there? You just dinked me? Sorry, what? Excuse me? How did that happen? All right. Yeah, because he got the flick in him. Flick. Up. Monacy puts him down. Dumping what little remains now of his util perfect usage of it. Now they want to go. This is the flash. Not going to work out well. The policy good for the first third as well. Nico should finish it, and he does so with style. Using that AK to great success. And just between the two of them, they find all five as we tie it. Good use of their util. Now the next phase is Hunter. How does he manage this one? He's got the advantage against that Galil, and he's done well to find near. Will G2 leave with eight? We find out in 35 seconds and counting. Can they even get into this site? It's very much covered in G2 members. And Fame, he's made it a little lighter. Hunter down. JKS, it's his turn. A missed shot from Monacy. Needs to hit one of these. Really struggling now. High flash. JKS needs the multi kill. 20 seconds and counting. Good flash. Fame still finds it. It's up to Monacy. And he's missed again. Has to nail Jane. That's the bomb with 14 seconds left. Fame and Jane combine. And G2, this one slips away. Awkward retake. Using every second they had, weren't they? A couple of nades available, but they're not got time to go for it. So, Hooks, he's going to take first contact. Nico need the headshot. Fame is having a great game, and kick it closes. VP8, G27. Could this be the final half of this final quarter final? Will G2 be cut down by VP? You can theorize why that might be the case, but I'm going to say VP are coming in and playing some solid Counter-Strike here today with individuals hitting some big shots. A double nade into James, trying to run the same pistol. Okay. Cops that, blown out of the server. You got to sit by for the next minute and 38 seconds. Jump through boiler, right? Sure. And it could that could mean anything, I'm right? With it you. could mean anything behind it. But the fact that G2 uh, just threw the stack nade, got the kill, and then committed into an open A site, I guess what you're saying is, is that... Oh. It, oof, damn, Nico, he's up to 16 now. They're going to take everything away from them. Look at this, G2. That is a masterclass in both anti-strat and execution. Yeah, I'm going to feel good about that one as Hooksy, right? Uh, Swanee as well, the fact that that one pays off. Going to be options like, remember what we saw... First G2 pistol? It is indeed. Bloody hell. But remember what we saw out of uh, them yesterday, where they just played Fame Bike, and they had mere headshot almost every round. How Monacy and JKS go about taking this fight now? Honestly, unprepared for it, and Jane will spank him out of the round. Perfect start, 5v4. This is more of those mind games, though. We've already spoken about the positions that the riflers from VP like to play, and it's very rare to see an AWPA on the T side come through apartments. Oh, Miz ready for this. Oops, he's not. Oh, he got, he got the info. He got the info. He's running out of bullets, and that is a bit of a messy one out of Hooksy. Has to be B now, doesn't it? Especially, yeah, considering... Oh, he's going to get caught he's here. He's got this rotation locked down as well. Jay feeling himself caught out by Hunter. Nico and Hunter in that 2v5. Fame will be hearing this shortly. And it will get Mir to cheat back over. If they could somehow isolate this duel, he's just going to have to be diligent on his can clears. Let him last. Let's him in. Mir should be on the side. Oh, never mind. Fame strikes. Nico. Chasing ghosts. Chasing ghosts. And it's going to be Mir looking to catch him with the bomb out. Oh, the smoke. Oh, oh. oh. Ooh. It's fine. Everything's fine. Nico. Oh, nails one. If he could somehow get the bomb down, Fame should have it. Fakes it out. Nails the headshot. I'm getting nervous here. Flit and kick it. Will they find him in the smoke? He's obscured their view. Gotten the bomb down. Says play on. Nico for a heroic clutch. The impossible. Five alive for VP and now a 1v2. The smoke, they don't know where he's gotten off to. Flit confirms he's probably still on the side. They're going to double peek him. Up. Oh, oh, God, he oh, nails oh. Flit as well. Kick it. He'll save the day, but Nico, that is a warning. Do not give me an inch, because I will take the mile. I kick it.
Elevated nade. Might be a bit deep here. Hunter. He missed Ooh, that one. Missed it completely. Yeah, yeah I thought he'd be caught of fluff in that. Pieces of you two. Need to fresh mag. They're coming in. Flip, flash. They've been caught off guard by this. Kick it spamming. Good damage onto Monacy. G2 fully committing. Very early days. Kick it. He was solid on the side, but he's eaten flashes. And Monacy, he puts him down. Monacy yeah! oh, with three. How has he done that? I have no idea. Bomb has been planted. They were under so much pressure. They really got flushed. Oh, and they're still oh, under oh, pressure. Oh, Look oh. at this hunt. <laughs> oh, he's dead. Surely five HP after the molly. Hoopsie. On the hunt, Nico should catch maybe one from the apartments. Fame as well, set up and spotted. Nico nails it. They got nothing. Sent back to spawn in their birthday suits. Huge hunt right there. Well, instantly. With, like the first frame of freeze time, James Orp. Yeah, he had enough. Zero dollars. He spent it all. He had the perfect amount. And now smiles are creeping onto the faces of G2. Here this it is. is. 18 HP or 19 rather. Oh. Spamming James as he pokes his nose out of the smoke and he's ready for flip as well. That's crazy. A couple of players going for those SMGs. And James, he's on that AWP. Oh, he could go for the wall bang. Oh, just go for the fight. Caught out. Monacy left, right. Good night. James investment squandered. They want the orb. Oh! He stole it. Yeah, he got it away. Oh my god, they got nothing. Fames will equip with something, but it's all onto the remaining site. B site open for business. Hooksy confirms it. And oh dear, VP. That, that's so well. Monacy and Fames' eyes both just yep. wide for that orb. Oh, Monacy, you know, he's going to have a shot. He's going to have a go. And he actually takes down Mir. Now, the orb is being saved. It looks like Fame's done enough. So they'll bring that through. But what? An average of about three and a half K. Yeah, that's the max loss bonus here. So, Well, especially because it's about map control and early presence. And g can just waltz up. That's a gap. That is a gap. That might lead to a fight for Flit. Is he ready for it? Oh, no. Is the answer to that, Hooksy? Well prepared and nails the shot. 15 already looms as the opening frag's been found. They three players now occupying CT spawn. If Kicker wants to rotate, James not going to be ready for this. He's well, I say that. He's looking for where those players have disappeared off to. No one's holding this. No one is holding this. Yo, James clearing left and loud. A brutal surprise as he rounds the corner. Now then, Fame and Mir can be maneuvering. Towards that B site, Kicket's hearing all of this. He wants to try and catch one ahead of time, but Hunter is switched on. And G2. This nade could be absolutely perfect. Boy. Oh. Uh, mm. The molly, though. The molly, though. Flushed him forward, should be taken oh. out. JKS. Oh, That's no. miserable. Well, they do get the extra bonuses we were just discussing. Hunter and Nico, they're getting off to no man's land. They need to support the other two. They've got the package. God, they're making a decision here. They're going for the beep split. JKS down to Jame. This could go wrong in so many different ways. You've got 20 seconds, lads. This really hinges on one fantastic frag, just like that. It's on Kickert. Maybe Monacy gets caught out. He has the bomb. He cannot afford to die. He has oh! one down, nearly lined up for a 10. They've got time to plant, but hanging on by a thread here. Bomb down. Cousins to close. Cousins to close. 70 HP between them. Up against Jame and Fame. It rhymes. But can they find Hunter? Burrow deep. Overheard. Scope fires off the shot. He should have the flank. Should be good for one here. James closing the gap quickly. He's got the first. Neat and tidy. And he's sending us to Vertigo with the final spray. 16 to 9. G2. Do not sweat on their map pick. Dropping one round on their T side. That is miraculous stuff right there. Only one for VP to boast. And that was after the performance versus phase yesterday. It was somewhat impressive. G2 handle business. You heard, you heard it from Swanee in the interview as well, just talking about how giddy they were to be getting to play some Inferno. Well, it's shown. We operate here. Quite quickly trundling over towards A. Mia. Nico, yeah. uh, Mia, Mia has the bomb, right? He does. Okay, well, he just joined the team. Oh, oh. and Monacy on that USP. His signature move, no silencer and no problems for G2's defense. We talk about Monacy and Nico having individual performance that gets the juices flowing. It could just be them. It was three from Monacy. Nico, maybe he can find the final frag as well because it's only Jame. And only going to be a matter of time here before JKS clears him out. Let's play with black bars, so if he pivots too far, he might get caught. And there you have it. Okay, bullet to the back. Coach Swanee happy with that. Yeah, they're pushing him. 
He's got the help as well. Yeah, and James trying as hard as he can to support. Nice avoid of the flash from Hooksy. Good positioning, map knowledge that doesn't transpire into a kill. Gosh, now JKS. <gasps> He's gone down as well. This is awkward from G2. Damage just not enough. And Mir through mid, he can cut off the rotations. This seems helpless. If Hunter and Nico can't get anything done, they go looking. Oh, and Hunter's dead to kick it as well. Lots of damage, but no lethality out of G2. Look, Look at this. Low. Look at this. This could be the Nico 1v5 if he knew. He doesn't have a head. Mir confirms it. And VP with a spotless start to the first gun round. Yeah, that's great. And that just shows uh, G2 with some, some pretty rubbish aim and a bunch of fights right there. And they're out mid. Hooksy, he just gave up that position. It's just now, JKS. Look at just this. Just JKS. Can he pass the test? Hooksy flattened. JKS got an awful lot on his plate here. He's hearing them all stampeding in. Does manage to get a multi-kill. Gets Mir as well. Overlooked by Kickit. Might not be enough here. Yeah. I mean, a 3v3, but as soon as that bomb goes down, this retakes on. Waiting for Nico to be in position to strike. Now with the tension drawn, steps made towards the generators. And Hunter, dead to flit. Good damage. Can't be converted. Monacy needs a frag. He gets nothing but a bullet between the eyes. And Nico. Maybe he can catch him on the exit and still make it costly. He will, as he takes two of the three. Kicker, he's going to be vulnerable at 28 HP. Nico will get away. Kicker lives to find another day. VP take the lead on this T side. They're going to flash high. I think he should be safe from it, but is he ready for this walk up? Yes, he is, but he doesn't even pull the trigger. Fame again, a huge contribution. A step in the right direction. VP looking for another T round. They chose the T side, and it's starting to show why. A Hooksy caught out. G2 flabbergasted and helpless. The individuals barely getting going. Yeah, but this is the thing, right? You have your three best players all worried about a ram at the start of the round. G2 on the pistol. This is a real fantastic haul from VP getting the... Juices flowing, Hunter, only the one. Nico, he's the highest flyer so far for G2, but he does nothing with that M4. Bomb has been planted. Close by, he can use them both. Made a decision for where he's going to play from, and they're all coming for him. Yeah, just like that. Would have loved to have brought it through. Jane gets it back. Fame will be delivering that, and already. Everything they need and more to execute in towards this site diligently. Check out the Utilis. Monacy just burning down to about half HP. Another one will be lobbed. Oh, make it an oh, aid and Mir. It's owned just beautiful. Him. Owned him. And there's more from Mir. Another multi-kill from Mir into the site. Overlooks Hunter. Maybe he can use the AK. Well, he has. And in combination with Hootsy, they have managed to hold on to the A site. Oh, they can get away. Look at the space that Flit's already trying to take here. Yeah, he's just got a high teller into yes, this. He's thinking about the A site. Uh, how much have they got? Okay, Molly... Could be useful. Confirmation of James' position, but every shot hit, and it's up to JKS now rocking the AK. How much can he get done? Flip, nice. Caught by JKS, but James poised on the conversion. Nails it, and Mir, he opened up that site. It's James that closes it. Expect behind that smoke. Kill for a teammate, wouldn't he? Oh, Molly forced him back. On the fade, it's very diligent they stuff. They can still do a full exec. Like they've got three mollies. Sight gonna be laid in with oh, flames here. Hooks, he's just trying to find a safe haven and he's been run down by the Mac 10. Hunter, nice on the dig. JK, yes, on that 5 7. They have managed to hit their shot. The front behind, Nico strikes. There should be a G2 round. Mir down and out, and there it is. A taste of victory once more. Yeah, still not really gonna feel with confidence. The two best rounds since the pistol and the conversion have been four rounds. VP just requiring one more here to win out the half. And that's a great shot from Hunter, isn't it? Flank in time, James Court trying to jump into action. And they handle this one. So, G2 something. Hooksy Whoa. trying to bring the energy, okay. Oh yeah, Flit eats the HE. They're boosting for him, and it will lead to an opening. Nico is the only one really managing to stay in a positive KD right now for G2. And he's looking for more trouble. Kick at his challenger. Molly's down, repositioning Hunter. This position rarely pays off. Will this be the exception? Flashed off, good teamwork, but not for long as Fame and Kicker combine. The short frag comes through. They're looking to plant, they have to plant. No one can disrupt, and if anyone tries too hastily, it could go down. Kicker, prime position here to collect and close. James nails one on the AWP, JKS is gone. Smoke down, still kick at the next to convert the eighth, and they're gonna win out this half already. Monacy alone, not enough health, and James confirms it, as that is eight 
to just three. They chose to start on this T side. Control their aggressive B, everything started fantastically, and then just getting pulled apart at the seams here. Great shooting from James on the AWP. Wanting to make sure they're able to trifle with trouble. JKS still in the same util set. Yeah, it's going to be awkward for Fame. He has to fight, but they've got a flash at least. He catches him while blind. And Hooksy there in support as well. Mir on notice. Flash and push. Hooksy horny. Need the trade. Still maintain the advantage. G2 got to get the juices flowing if they want to have a chance at joining that semi-final crowd. VP look feel like they've got something to prove, or at least their gameplay implies a such spotted. Nico spotted the leg. And gets the head, flit, overlooks the position of the forward Kovac. Yeah, you see that. Uh, Modesty threw out the sandbag one way. Oh, Should be more here. This. this is perfect from Nico. Two and down. Kick it just the one and uh, yeah, an impossible one. Maybe you're going to watch a 40 second save. Yeah, you just saw that smoke on top of the sandbag uh, towards the ramp there because there's still money for a buy here for VP going forward, even if kick it gets found. Is the early timeout trend uh, being bucked? Oh, here? what? Monacy geeks it, bangs out kick it. <laughs> Okay. I don't think I've ever seen yeah, that before. That's, I've seen it with an AWP. I haven't Not seen it with a rifle. Four. Yeah, that right there. Okay, Monacy, we see you. Well, you're still going to have to do three more of those on the trot to just make this a one-round game. I kick it, couldn't believe it. Oh, oh. Just wondering where he got yeah. shot from. All right, well, the molly's in the sight. It didn't work for them against the pistols. Maybe it could against the rifles. JKS with a molly and a HE to block. He's going to have to get this out. This could be his redemption on the B site. A must-win round to recover the half. He's got nades in his hands, and Fame's been his arch-nemesis, throwing his body through the smoke, and they're not ready for him. It's a problem. Five seconds, they need to be planted. Kick it, kick it. I think he's just got it in time. If they could just disrupt it, but oh, VP, running the clock down to the final millisecond. They will leave with nine. An incredible conversion. Oh, that's ridiculous. I'd be throwing my hands up in the air. Just that, that, how? This is fame. This is great from Fame. Understanding that he needs to alleviate that pressure or they're not getting into the side at all. Great work from him and oh, the bomb just going down. And you got to say, guys, we need just one kill on that site to slow things down, but not to happen. VP are really oh, gaming so now. So good from Fame. For teams of a native tongue, they can play slower. Yeah, poor Justin. No one speaks Australia. <laughs> oh, Monacy, quick to the draw. Set flip down under. Yeah, see you later. A really passive setup on B means no info. James all spotted out. They're ahead of this, Alex. Yeah. These two are going to get overrun again. They've been made to look foolish on this side of the map. You're they dead. Have. And it's going to be the kick at Amir Combo. Oh! This time flattened. Both the B defenders hit their shots and Fame the next victim. As G2, they'll get one more taste of a CT round. The round where it feels like they get caught off guard and they get it done. Both of them. But they've come few and far between. Nico in the power position to guarantee the round. That's Jamie, he'll give it a good go. Heading towards that A site here, and Nico wants to get under his skin, into his spine with the blade. Five is what they have to work with, folks. G2, they've got two minutes to think this one through, get themselves into that flow state, into that hyper focus, because at the end of the next half, we lose one of these two teams. Looking for those early answers. No toes spotted, but here they come. Just a warning shot, connects into Monacy's shoulder. James trying to delay with a short smoke. Quite deep, they can get through that. He's hoping for the great screen and a jumping block from Hoopsy. He's found a pair of frags to open up the sights and to keep G2's hopes. Another semi-final alive. Oh, even Mir catching one through the smoke into his brain. He lives on at 9 HP. There should be no way for this one to go wrong now. That was an interesting round because they had Nico and Hunter as the two deploying all the util. As uh, they sent the other three peons in, Mir will grab something. That's 300 bucks. That's a nice kill there. Well, Very much. Add that one to the tally. Gets away. Doesn't have anything to go along with it, but 2200. Let's see what he wants to buy. They just keep trading utility, and this is the little gap, the little window. Hunter slipped through, and he's overlooked by Fame. Should be an absolute free frag here. And he strikes. Still, Fame gets one. Needed multi. Hunter precise into the second. Nails kick it to the wall. Hooksy forward. Double smoke. This looks perfect now. So long as no one gets caught by a smoke spam. VP, they're likely going to be wanting back and away. 
and playing the long game. It's, uh, I think one of the keys there, Virtus Pro did. Oh, Flit. Whoops. Gives away his position here. Not be punished for that one. Yeah, I think one of the keys. Uh, he does live to fight another day. Resmoke out from Kicker. We've got about 35 seconds, and Hunter, yeah, he's doing it all on his own. He strafes into the fight, and fame. But they're stumps. They aren't going anywhere. They don't have any room. They're going to have to commit right now, and it's going to be very, very light on. Flit's about to get the info over towards A if he wants to continue to push here. 20 seconds left. Around. Yeah, he's G2. jumping for it. Great shot out of Monacy. They have to go. They must. 15. Full commit, JKS trying to entry frag here, and with Nico's help, they've hit the shots. It's only Mir, up close, eating flashes, pushing. Monacy nails it, eight seconds. Jane with one, but they are gonna plant. And then the last couple of seconds, G2 give VP a taste of their own medicine. Oh, and you can see Jame having to concede this one right here, but again, like it was almost victim of the clock right there. It's still the round, it's still the winning ways. And this is the one I'm talking about. 20 seconds, Fame jumps up. Oh. Probably not expecting to see an awful lot right there, but. That kill. And another flavor added to the mix. Now, Mir, he's going to have a head-to-head -head with two of them. It's Hooksy. Oh, and he nails it. That's M4 huge from Hooksy. from Hooksy. Cracks open the round, and he's already quick to wrap around. Kickett should have him if he commits. Nico's coming in from behind as well. He's got one. Kickett underneath him. Nico overlooks it. A double kill from Kickett. He keeps him level. Still though, G2, G should have the leg up if they can get that bomb down. Not a priority right now. Yet to reload his kick at a double kill, great. Rotation through, he's got his team's assistance. And it's Hunter that wants to investigate that little gap in the smoke. Is he gonna push through and catch kick at here? Flash, push, clear, oh! headshot, Hunter. Big plays from Hunter Kovac. He will go down, but two to find in the 1v3, flip. Missed shot out of Monacy. He's got a little bit of time to work with. He's got the kit. He's got the smoke. If he can isolate a duel, if he can find JKS, it's awkward for Monacy. That's the smoke down. JKS spotted close, and he is just going to hold it. Someone better run at him. Someone better find him. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, that would have been awkward. <laughs> Imagine if he pulls that one off. Closer than I think they realize right there, G2. Warpath is JKS. He wants a taste. He wants blood. Gets the trade into the A site. Next victim is Mir. Quick and precise on the M4. An escort. That bomb into the site. No on hurry. The fade, on the fade. Nico looking to play it. James considering the options of that. They'd love a distraction. Someone to draw attention. And on the fade. Oh, he didn't spot much. He oh, James does. Nails it onto Nico. Monacy does not connect on that first wall bang, and now up against the odds, it's Hunter's down next. VP quickly tying things back up. And a pace change out of G2 achieves nothing. Nice try, misses his shot, Mir will collect, and we're back. He spams his gun as the oh. flash sails. It's Flip's beautiful really team Nico's hearing this. Nico's hearing the jumps. Yeah. Nico aware, but he's also concerned if it's a bait. Uh, is Flip not ready for this? I don't think so. There's two of them. He's not ready at all. And he might even have a shot onto James. They know the where he is. They know exactly where he is. hooksy has got him as well. An advantage, G2. Maybe Mir's got something here. Maybe not. Nico on the frag. An immediate save call made. And Monacy, he's slinking into B to stop it. Bomb has been planted. Fame. Oh, come no, on, Monacy. No, no, it's 11-11 no, no. in a quarterfinal. Lads. Not ready for kicker. It's going to lose his AWP. And James shouting at him now. Hey, lad. I wouldn't mind that. Uh, if you can hold on to it for the rest of this bomb, I'd like that AWP. Oh, they're closing down him right now. The evacuation route, it has been closed. He is quite truly surrounded here, poor Kicket. He's going to have to find his way out of this one. JKS will be the first one to take the duel, and Kicker gets the better of him. Wouldn't even do that much ja damage here. And ooh, Fuxi, he has to be the one to get it done. Can scavenge the AWP back, gets that in the hands, and great work from Nico. That was a good little seesaw, right? Got to get past this four-man stack on the site. Who's going to draw blood first? JKS out, cool, short, clear. Now he's got a lot of bodies to deal with. It's good from Hooksy. Jane fights back. Jumping through the smoke was Hooksy for more, and it's getting awkward now. Monacy with, does find one with the flames. A 2v4, now three. And from behind, Flip will find at least one. Nico in the clutch. Smoke to play around. Up and over. Eye on time now needs to get that bomb. Worried about so many different angles. He does hit the oh, shot. No. Oh, fame. Oh, yeah. So well restrained. He catches the trade and we are still all tied up. They don't really have to peek from these positions. You can chill. 
Yeah, I'm honestly just hoping and praying he can catch something. It's Kicker punishing around his own smoke, and there could be more. Hunter's trying to save G2 here. Oh, and he has with a beautiful triple. And that's another G2 round. They needed that one. And Hunter, the big game player with a triple. I see this one again they here. They needed him, bro. Yeah, look at the lineup here. Just trying to strafe in, get them in the choke point. Beautiful. Oh. You can't get luckier than that. Hunter just loving that one. A massive round. And you know what that's done? VP. Oh, absolutely. Let's see if G2 to get the... Uh... Oh, this is going to be Fight Club. This is insane. L look at the two radars. They get yeah, directly gonna, above each gonna other. Full commit. Don't. 40 seconds. Oh, oh no, Nico eats lead from the mirror. Oh no, another from Flit. It's falling apart for them. Hooksy and Hunter trying to hold on. The rope is slippery. JKS is so low. Flit though, he could do a lot. They have the crossfire. Jamin Flit with 25 to defend their honor on a force buy. Their hopes of a semi-final hang in the balance. It's again Hunter with the multi-kill. He has to plant. Never mind. He'll do it all with the headshot. Back-to-back -back rounds where Hunter delivers. Where Hunter just activates here like a madman. They lose two. This is a three on five. Fight Club just kicks off on A. And Hunter, he's had enough. He wants to get to bed. Just two more rounds now for G2 to lock in the semi-final against Vitality. A little bit lighter on as far as his impact. Let's see if he can turn the tides of round 27. Yeah, he's a gamer, though. He's an aimer. Can he do it when they need to most? 11 bullets. Might want to reload, son. You'd think so. Nico, what was that onto James? Mere one, mere two, teaching us how to count. And kick it, pushing the smoke, that's ballsy. JKS will be quick to punish. It's JKS this time with the multi-kill and going wide was Mir as it finds another triple kill from Mir. Weapon upgrade for a moment. Nico will catch him, a one versus two for fame. And he's gonna go down to Nico. 15 now as G2, one more round. And you can see how stressful this series must have been. We are into tomorrow now. Gonna play forward, gonna look for a fight. You can see James trying to line something up here. They'll get what they're looking for. Yeah, Lots of bodies down here. Isolate him. Nico forward. It's all about the timing here. Spots out Flit. Can he control the spray? He Turn does. The flash. Turn the flash! He's a god among men as JKS can do the rest. And G2, what frag away now from the semi finals. What a recovered half. Their T sides are to be feared. VP boasts 10 on their T side. G2 say we can do better. And only fame playing upon the fade. Bodies in front of him. And cleared out by Hunter. They'll do it. And they'll do it in style. A T side dominance as G2 secure the semi finals at Gamers 8. No, they had to work hard for this one. 16 11 loss on Mirage. They go to Inferno 16 to 9 with a phenomenal T half. And T half, keep that in your mouth. G2 getting it done here on Vertigo. The first half full of frustrations. JKS absolutely dismantled over towards B. Mid hemorrhaging as well. But it's all about that T side. Calling them back into style. Nico with massive, massive contributions. And that's a Vitality versus G2 semi final locked in. How exciting. That's something to look forward to. Make sure you set your alarms, put it in your calendar. We will have that one to look forward to tomorrow. VP, though, my main takeaway is this is a team back in business. Sure, operating with Kick It in the absence of Norbert, still convincing, still testing some of the very best in the bracket. They had no, by no means an easy